You thought you were in for inches upon inches of snow. Uh, this next system is probably going to be a big disappointment. Yeah, you can put the shovels away. You're going to want to keep the umbrella handy, though. Lots to talk about, so we're going to check in right now with Chief Meteorologist Matt Leach in the Weather Center. Yeah, I mean, I might even say that the umbrella may not be even as handy as you might think with the wind, uh, but still, that'd probably be yeah, something good to have know. around. Yeah, Wow. Yeah. A lot going on. There is, and, and we've been deliberately vague when it comes to the snow because of this tricky situation. Well, we'll talk about it here, and of course in more detail in my full forecast because it's hardly straightforward. And so here's a look at what we're expecting, kind of the bigger picture. Uh, we are going to see some rain and snow, obviously possible throughout the day tomorrow, both. Uh, bursts of heavy wet snow possible, especially in the afternoon as that low pressure si uh, center winds up through our area. So rain and snow is likely during the day with a dry snow at night that could cause some blowing and drifting concerns late Friday into early Saturday. Higher snow amounts would be north and west of Fort Wayne where the rain's not expected to be as ongoing as it will to the south and east. Slushy midday uh, conditions are expected with those freezing roads late. Here's a look at the snowfall accumulation uh, expected with moderate to heavy amounts across northwest Indiana, but for the rest of us, light to maybe at times moderate amounts expected. Uh, the other story, bitter cold temperatures Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. We've added Tuesday on the first alert of weather day criteria here with those single digit high temperatures and wind chills between 10 and 20 below.